Hello everyone! Welcome back to the last story in the last part. I do believe we uh, helped Horus find his stuff and now we can uh, uncurse items. So I do believe I left that off for this video. So let's see what we can uh, uncurse. No, I uncursed everything already. Okay, so... What was I doing? I think we have to go back to the castle and talk to Therius or General Ashtar. So, I... Oh, yeah, and while I'm here, I may as well check out the arena. And I remember... Seeing... While in editing, you probably... Yeah, when that happened, I ran right past the guy! He was like somewhere over here. Where is... I think... Yeah, he was like right here, wasn't he? God damn it. I swear to God, I was going... past here when it happened. I specifically put it in editing, too. I was like... What, three or four days ago? I'll check the other red flag spot if he's not there. I'll, uh... Try again later, I guess. Try again in the other spot. Nope. Looks like you found yourself something nice in the sea cave. Yeah, the place is real trove of gnome silver. Gnome Silva. Trying to like it's been a week since I edited that video. I was like, God freaking damn it. It was it was that much of a face palm moment as uh, like been looking for seedlings for so damn long. And then I find that I ran right past the dude. Try looking over here again. See if I can't find the slippery bugger. <clears throat> I think I may have been too late to grab it now. It was definitely somewhere over here. I remember that. Come on, you bugger. He has got to be around here somewhere. I will hunt you down and buy your products! Where is this shady salesman? Maybe it was up here. I'm gonna have to watch that video again, aren't I? That was what, like episode 70? God damn it, the slimy bugger! Ouch! Master of hiding, I can tell you that much. Let's just get on to the over the other side. I <coughs> have to sneeze. Pulled my mic away in time, so hopefully it wasn't too loud. Huh. Oh hey, there's something in here. Party magical attack plus one. So while we're trying to find this slippery bugger, <coughs> and my nose clogs up, 
I am getting these seedlings. Where is Where is the island actually going anyway? Uh, why don't I tell you a story that happened to me today? <coughs> so, I was downstairs like I am now minding my own business and my sister comes in and he was like over here wasn't he maybe he was on the other side of the bridge there he is he's on the bullet bridge buy buy all the seedlings okay no I can only buy one seedling Freaking fantastic. To the seedling planting place. So my sister comes in and she sees the case to this game, the last story. And <laughs> she picks it up, shows it to me, and is like, boobs. And I'm like, what? And she, she goes, like, she looks through the entire concept art like booklet and it's like oh she's not even dressed as much as the guy she's not even clothed and I'm just like C come on like that up this is not about what they look like it is about their personalities but she she wasn't buying anything uh, like any of it it's like I can't play a g <laughs> can't care for a female character that, you know, doesn't have breasts. Uh, plant a seedling, yes. And so, I go to confront her about this. It's like, are you ready to apologize for your outbursts? And you know, the first thing out of her mouth was? It's not, what outburst, or no, or why should I? It was boobs, and she walked off. That was it. Like, I had this long argument about how, you know, it's about their personalities, you're objectifying women, you can't, you're saying they can't be in video games without just being an object to attract the boys, and she just completely threw me off. Anyway, so I've planted the seeds. The seeds of destiny. If your destiny be, uh, pumpkins. Kitty. If thy destiny be pumpkins, then I have planted the seeds of destiny. So yes, he was on the bridge the entire time. Slippery devil. But now we have the seedlings. We have the power. Of seedlings. Seedlings! <clears throat> That's gonna be the, like the next Dinkleberg. Ah, uh, go now! Or at least I wanna make that the next Dinkleberg. It's just like seedlings! One can dream. Seedling house! Okay, that's enough of that. Um. Yeah, let's. Are you ready? Yes, I am ready. Way to shove me. Oh. What is this shaking? Enemies? Is yeah, no. Crack? Not. Mate. Well. Oop. This looks like a cutscene! Huzzah! <coughs> oh my god! Gurak prepared to march to war. 
Although impressed that something as vast as Lazulus Island could move, they were not deterred from their purpose. <clears throat> These Garak are fearless. Cursed infernal Garak. It's dangerous here. We have to take the Count somewhere safe. Zael and the others retreated with the Count, whilst defending themselves against the descending Gulak. They cannot be allowed to damage the cannon. I'll lead. Follow me. Well, this is getting exciting, huh? Yeah, this is great to be back home. That's a long story. <clears throat> but before that story, I'm probably going to get into a battle here. My castle. You dare to come here a second time? I'll murder you all, damn. Protect the count. <laughs> yes, sir. Oh, Jesus. What in the name of bloody savages, I tell you. Please right, so these guys were weak to the ice thing. Do we have anything that's uh, ice that's relatively strong? Deals times two slash damage. Chance of ten percent chance of inflicting instant death. Does that mean its attack is effectively sixteen thousand? Um. Blue blade, that's the thing with the... Freezes the wounds and afflicts, attacks the ice element. Yeah, that is an acceptable lower in power for something they're weak to. And she got the paladin three. <clears throat> right. Element hits. Uh, do we have any casters? No, we do not. But they most certainly do. We're gonna have to fix that. Ow, pain. Right, and... That's the problem. You can't just, like, shove your way through enemies. You have to bash them all. Well, I think I'm surrounded. Oh. He is a caster. Kill the, Hit the caster. Thank you. Thank goodness for the power, the power of the outsiders giving you perfect vampirism. It's minor perfect vampirism. But it helps. Because if you can avoid enough damage, you can basically get your entire health bar back. Also, when my sister was going through the art book, she's like, well, he, she's perfectly dressed. We were on the York page. I am not even kidding. Also, I have no idea what she had wrong with Marania, but, like, in the book, she's, like, very fully clothed. As, like... She had a, a little bit of cloth bunched up at her backside. And my sister's like, she has a, like, bushel or something? I don't know quite what she said. But she looked very pissed, and I had no idea what she was talking about. Of course, I don't think it was what she thought it was. Can I defuse this? Cannot be negated by diffusion. Ah, diggity daffodil. And we do not have... Okay. So, I need to get out of here. And into here. Let's all... Retreat to the... Healing circle. I can only control me and Dagrin. That's fan-freaking-tastic. Ah... Uh, we're both in the heal circle, so never mind. Uh, 
Hopefully we can negate this. Little damage. Oh god, we're surrounded. 